Oh god, must I? I really I do. Ah hell. I'm 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 being told that if I do not produce one of these videos, uh people are going to be really mad at me and and I don't want people to be mad at me. I'd rather have them be all mad at Phil. I I don't I I've done nothing wrong, ladies and gentlemen. I did everything correct. I did nothing wrong. Okay, so you know the you know what the whole premise of this little series is. I watch a video from our f dear best friend Dark Side the Spill. Isn't that how Andy Dick referred to him as? Anyway, I hope you're all having a great day. So today, let's see, is it? Nope. There you go. So today I'll be reacting to the DSP Dent Tractor Snow Carl returns to trigger Phil into another June the King documentary coat. But then again, it isn't really hard to di uh, to trigger that dipshit, is it really? Come on, let's be honest. On, on the level of difficulty of triggering people, Philly Boy is not that hard to trigger. I, I, I mean, I mean, like, on, on the level of difficulty, he's pretty low. I, I mean, I think the only person that's a little bit more difficult to trigger is LTG. But he, but he also has some good... Uh, good points when he gets triggered and everything but anyway yeah Phil's pretty low tier when it comes to getting triggered but anyway let's get to it shall we this is from our friend duty streams <laughs> it looks like our boy duty streams is kicking uh, is rolling out the old uh, intro I haven't seen this intro in quite a long time Now, when I saw this uh, intro before, I saw the kit picture or the video here of Jasper. I refer to call that damn cat Jasper Kitty. Who in the fucking right mind refers to a cat as their name and then Kitty? Oh, Jesus Christ. Anyway, I thought that Jasper was actually wearing a coat. But no, nah, it's just the way that, uh, you know, he, that he was uh, created for this video. And I was thinking, if that was a coat... Damn, uh, Duty Streams did a good job because he gave that poor mutilated cat more care and attention than its owners actually gives it. Yeah, I, I went there. I went there. So what? Okay, cat number one, you're not supposed to put paper towel, uh, paper towels, paper plates on the stove. It doesn't work like that, lady. Wait, 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 hold, hold the fuck up. Well, I just realized this. Let's go back. Okay, number one, why is her makeup running? That's not even what I was going to... Why is her makeup running? And number two, are, wow. They have their laundry room and the kitchen all in one room. Wow, that, that, that's, that's... Wow. <laughs> Oh, I see one of Cat's boyfriends is here right now. Hey, I gotta give uh, Duty Streams uh, some some mad credit. He actually even got Phil's quivering down. Wow, look at that. That is pretty damn good, dude. Hold on, let me fix my mic. It's a little bit too loud. Okay. All right, excellent. All right, our first tube of the day. Silence is gold. Okay, thank you. He hasn't been around recently. He'd like me to recap the last year to two years. No. <laughs> are, are you expecting Filbert to actually put together a, uh, to put together an answer that would require a little bit of work? Are you forgetting who the fuck this is? This is Phil. Filbert. Philly. Philarino. Uh, Phil Philly. Phil fuck. Fuck it. Anyway. The guy, the guy can't do any kind of work like that. There's nothing in his sector, ladies and gentlemen. Don't you ask him what? 
Can you tell me what? Fuck, what the hell is wrong with you, Snow Carl? S since the fact that Filbert is not uh not berating this snow carl guy i'm guessing that snow carl must be uh one of uh philip's uh sycophants i guess you could say <laughs> i'm not gonna do that here's what i will say we had a good year why no drama what <laughs> what <laughs> no drama <laughs> wow he he is to the point now he can actually fucking lie and say it with a straight, well, almost straight face. Almost straight face. He, he, no drama. No drama. Ever when I first came back to uh, follow this dipshit while I've been on my break, I heard him talking about, uh, oh, what, what's that motherfucker's name? The, the guy, the guy who, uh, sex chatted somebody. Uh, uh, Dr. Disrespect. Oh yeah, he's not, he's not drama at all. He doesn't deal with drama at all. And if I remember correctly, didn't he also talk about Boogie recently also? Totally no drama, ladies and gentlemen. No drama. This is a drama-free zone. Drama-free zone. That Yes, sir. He deals with no drama. But let him tell you about Dr. Disrespect. Let him tell you about these other lol cows and everything. <laughs> oh god and the sad thing is these these idiots that actually watch this guy the, the remaining viewers that he actually has not the trolls i fucking hate the trolls myself actually see to me there's a difference between detractors and trolls troll me as a detractor i just want to literally watch this guy crash and burn and have to get a real fucking job Trolls will actually fund this idiot and keep this whole train wreck going. There's a difference between detractors and trolls, in my opinion. And then there's the, the, the poor, handicapped people that actually thinks that this guy cares about them. It's been a drama for a year. I haven't involved myself in drama. I've stayed completely out of drama. People keep trying to suck me in. I refuse to participate. Instead, it's just been really good. Now, I know we're going to have some drama coming up in August. When this documentary about me hits, but at the very same time, it's literally treading the same ground everyone else has. Oh my god, he is fucking shaking right now. This is what I was talking about, uh, uh, du duty streams. He did an awesome job at making he the guy shake, because I'm getting fucking motion sickness watching this guy quiver right now. Look at this! That documentary, Look at this! It'll be stuff about my past, like pre-YouTube, that a lot of people have never Oh my god, oh my god, I'm, I'm getting motion sickness, holy shit. The YouTube side stuff has been so arduously covered by so many people already. There's no way it's going to cover any new ground. It's going to rehash a lot of it. Um, I, I don't really care. I've already been there, done that. There's nothing new to talk about in that regard. In fact, if anything, the last few years, it's just been more positive stuff rather than the same over negative shit that they like to focus on. What is this fucking positive stuff that he keeps mentioning? I've only been watching the, you know, uh, following Philip since I came back on the 18th of uh, June when my vacation started. What is this fucking positive stuff? All I, all, literally the same shit that he talks about in 2024 is the same shit he talked about in 2020 when I last uh, checked in on this guy. Money, tips, detractors, his home, his mutilated cat, his wife. There's nothing fucking new here. Literally, if you looked at this this Jamoke from 2024, it's the same Jamoke from 2015, the same Jamoke from 20, 20, 2009. There is nothing new here. Over and over, it's the same shit ad nauseum. Oh my god, he still swishes the fucking liquid. Why, why the fuck does he do that? I mean, like... Oh, big ups for uh, blue or uh, grape flavored water. I think that was it was either grape flavored or blueberry flavored, but you can actually find it at Safeway slash Kroger or Albertsons. But yeah, big ups for flavored water, I guess. So I'm not too worried about it. I'm really not. I think it's gonna be fine, and we're gonna continue on with a great year, no problems. I'm gonna stay out of drama as much as I can. We got good variety <laughs> of stuff cover it covered, right? I'm actually uh doing well in regards to, you know, gameplay 
and, and viewership and support. Things have been better. You know, earlier this year was a little slow as I played Baldur's Gate 3. Things picked up after that. He says that support and everything is good, but there's I've seen fucking video after video after video saying that this guy has had low uh, low contributions. Yeah, you know, or or interact or interactions or whatever the fuck he likes to call it every now and then. I don't, I don't think the business is doing it that good. I think our boy Philly here. I think he's blowing smoke up his own ass. So yeah, that's it. That's the summary. Uh, all right, guys. So we're gonna do just a little bit of Q and A, but before we get to that, I just want to say please, guys, support the streams today. You know the deal. When it comes to my streams, I'm a crowdfunded individual, and therefore it is you guys. Uh, oh my god, I'm, I'm about to get, actually get nauseous. I'm gonna give me something to drink. I will be right back. How the fuck do people not get nauseous watching this guy move around like that? Oh my god, it. If you want to make people sick or you want to interrogate people at Gitmo, put on one of these, one of Phil's videos. I swear to God. Uh, supporting the streams that allows me to make a living doing it and continue to enjoy what I love. You can pay him. You can pay him. To play games, what he loves to do. Hell, I don't get paid from anybody. And I make videos all the time and I still have a fucking job. But you can pay him to do what he loves to do. Uh, if you could support the streams today, that would be great. Um, there's many different ways you could do that, including super chats, super stickers, memberships, gifted memberships, and tips. I try to raise 50 bucks every stream and tips that I do. Uh, and, uh, yeah, that's that. He can't even give you a fucking reason why. He just like, give me money. Give me fucking money. Just, just give me money. Give, give, motherfucker, give me money. Don't you know who I am? I'm Dark Side Phil. I got three I got three sores on my ass that I've developed because of you assholes. I want you to give me some money. If, if people gave me money, which I do not encourage at all, I would literally, like, inst I would literally, like, kind of invest all that money into, like, my setup and everything to make my, to make my video production the best that it can be. I wouldn't use on fucking DoorDash, that's for damn sure. I will shout them out when you, when you contribute, okay? Alright, cool. Alright, sound all good? Right. Let's open up the chat to Q&A. I, got, I have no other shout outs to do. I've shouted out all the contributions so far. <laughs> One dollar. <laughs> and it was from that Snow Carl guy. Oh, and Hair of the Dog, by the way. Okay. Sounds good. Yes, Jasper does know when we're sad and tries to comfort. And, and Cat, particularly. Both of us. Yes, he does. The cat, the cat doesn't... Fe the cat does not care... If they're upset or sad. No, the cat's probably fucking starving. It's probably starving and it's going to either cat or Phil and be like, Feed me! <laughs> Feed me! He can tell. He doesn't know what's going on. But he can tell when we're upset by something and he does try to be nice and comfort. He does. My Rest God. in peace to Shelley Duvall who passed away today. Actress who famously played the mother uh, in... Uh, oh my god, that fucking jiggling. Many oh other my god. And shows as well over the years. Yes, that was just brought out in my chat. <laughs> I I watch I watch him jerking and it feel and I for you know until I get my bearings, I literally think it's my blood pressure. I'm like, "Wait, is that my is that my vision that's doing this?" But no, that's actually fucking Phil. I thought I was about to have a stroke until I realized that it's Phil fucking sitting in his chair jerking and everything. I guess that is true. Jade says I have a game over sign just like Bison. He just realized that, but yeah. Oh my god! You have a you have a game over sign like a whole bunch of other people in a video game characters or whatever. Oh my god! Phil has a door over there. That is so revolutionary. Phil has a door. Oh my god! Actually, you're right. I just realized that too. Now that you said that. Oh my God, this dead, this quietness. Yeah. 
Uh, Snow Carl tipped another dollar and says, what are you doing about your hand? His fucking microphone is fucking... That's how nervous this motherfucker is. What the hell is he so nervous about? I thought everything was good. I thought that, t I thought that he was getting enough contributions. I thought that he was drama free. Why the fuck is this motherfucker shaking like this? The only thing I see that shakes like this are those fucking chihuahuas. And you're doing any exercises. I mean, as I get older, I'm going to have to start doing more regular exercises. Stretch exercises. Regular exercises! Make sure that the nerves don't get pinched. To make sure that everything's working well. I do have these hand exercisers that I can use. Okay? That I can use? But, you know, I'll, I'll, I, if it starts to hurt worse and or give me more issues, I will likely, you know... Do more research into the proper things that I should be doing and start doing. You can stop playing video games for eight plus hours a day. Are you fucking crazy? Are you fucking crazy, you stupid loser? I This is my job. I can't quit my job. There's nothing in my sector to do. Dude, snort. I haven't gotten serious about it yet. Simply because it hasn't gotten that bad yet. But it very well could. Right? By the way, if you haven't noticed, I've been frequently checking my phone to see if there's any updates on... The we don't fucking care. We don't fucking care. Delivered. And as of right now, there's still none. It just keeps saying, now arriving today, 12 to 3 p.m. And I keep checking, and it keeps saying, out for delivery, but doesn't give any update. So I guess it's out for delivery, but it's not... No, it's a it, no. They they took it to a junk heap. They, they took it to a junk heap, and they're leaving you there just wondering. Fucking God's sake, be patient, you... Prick. The next couple of hours, which sucks. So I guess we're gonna play with this bootleg setup with the Hayabusa stick and the crooked button to start. See how that goes, and then uh, once the Sanwa shows up, maybe do the swap when it shows up. I don't know if we'll be doing uh, ranked today, but because of this issue, we'll see. But let's at least give it a shot and see how I do. <laughs> okay. Sounds good. <laughs> Why not swap Riven and Street Fighter? Because Riven is a late night chill stream that has its audience and still. Every time he, f this guy fucking says chill, it makes me want to s slap myself. It makes me literally want to go fucking ape shit crazy. This motherfucker doesn't know what chill is. I recall uh, seeing a video during my break where he literally. Uh, where he was braiding, I think he's braiding a, uh, another Street Fighter player. And then one of his viewers said, dude, that's not really chill. And then Phil's like, oh, I can be chill. I'm chill right now. This motherfucker doesn't know what chill is. He does not know what fucking chill is. In the late shift, people are used to coming by for late night chill streams. They're not used to coming by in the day for Riven. So if I did Riven right now, I'd have a much smaller audience than I should probably have for a day stream. And that's why I'm not going to do that. Right? <clears throat> you would die a happy woman if you could see me in the cloud wig one more time. I'm not a children's entertainer, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not like the rest of those guys. I'm I, what you see here is what you get: the unadulterated, real f DSP gaming. I'm not a clown. I'm not a muppet. I'm not like those other guys out there who dresses and goes, oh, oh, "Look at me, ladies and gentlemen! Look at me!" Oh, oh, oh. He, he, this guy is a real motherfucking man. DSP, he ain't like those other losers out there. He, this guy doesn't fucking dress up. He doesn't do anything like that at all. He 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 is one hundred percent. Why the fuck are you putting on a wig, Phil? Uh, put, oh, well, why are you putting on a wig, Phil? Not a chill. Don't don't look at this. Don't don't look. Don't look. He's not a children's entertainer, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> no, seriously, why the fuck do you have that on? You look like a fucking piece of shit. You look like a transvestite three days past your shave. <laughs> what the fuck is up with this? You're not a children's... Get that fucking shit off you. <laughs> oh my 
god. Oh my god, it's like he's literally looking at the camera. He's like, do I actually look good? In, do I look good in this? Man, I look fucking good. I look fucking good, yeah. <laughs> Not a children's entertainer, ladies and gentlemen. I bring back the YouTube challenge series for fighting games. There'd have to be more than one fighting game that I want to play at a time. Right now, I'm so outdated on Tekken. I wouldn't even be able to go back to it. When the Versus uh, collection comes out, I do want to play all those games. The collection is going to have a significant amount of games that I do want to act. Okay, serious serious question for anybody who's watching this. How is it that he does not consider himself a children's entertainer when he dresses up like this? No, seriously, I, I, I'm really wondering what the logic is in his mind that he can say, Oh, I'm not like a children's entertainer at all. I'm not a Muppet. And then he does this. Oh, look at me, look at me, I'm a chosen. Actually play. So I would actually check out a bunch of those. Maybe we could do something with that. I don't know. Oh, look at me, I'm a chosen. I'm a big boy. Did my toilet sue me for, your, for abuse? Well, luckily for me, my toilet is an inanimate object. Not capable of sentient thought, so no. He doesn't fucking know what sentient means. I'm All a right, big boy. I guess we should uh, adjourn the show. Please take that fucking wig off. Street Fighter. Take that and fucking wig off. I'm going to be on my stick right now. So thank you guys for watching the Level 1 Podcast. I hope you enjoyed this uh, epic finale of the show. And uh, tomorrow, I will obviously let you know about what happened. When, if and when the joystick arrived. We don't fucking care about your joystick. Stuff, right? There you go. I'm not a Don't look at those pictures! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! <laughs> I'm not a children's entertainer. I just dress up like my favorite video game characters. I'm not a children's entertainer at all. <laughs> oh my god, he looks like a fucking transvestite in these pictures too. Please, some, his new name, it's not Ken. This is a whole new uh, Street Fighter character. It's not Ken, ladies and gentlemen. It's Farron. Farron. It's a mixture of Phil and Karen. Farron! This is Farron! It's Ryu! Alright, oh, Ryu! Right there. And Farron! <laughs> oh, you fucking clown piece of shit! By the way, Sarah, uh, with the 17 month membership message saying, What a way to celebrate 17 months. Love you, DSP. Alright. Guys, thank you. Who. If this is not sociopathic or narcissistic behavior, also. I don't know what is. A motherfucker having to have all these pictures of himself. I would understand him having a lot of pictures if it was like, you know, from his like a like from his mom taking pictures of himself. But this is fucking narcissistic beyond belief. You see you tomorrow. Peace out. Farron! Farron! What the hell happened to you, man? All right, we went too long on the show. <laughs> we totally went too long on the podcast. We were my eyes! Oh my fucking god! Which one of his mentally deficient fans thinks this is a good idea? Really? Who the fuck thinks this is a good idea? I'm so eager to gab today, but I do want to get stuff going here. All right, my regular stream. So let's. He looks like a drunkard in this picture. Ferret. Get over here. Get stuff get set up here and going. Oh my god, he actually didn't have anything set up. What the fuck? I'm not a children's entertainer, ladies and gentlemen. Hold on, let me turn this off. Hold on, let me turn this off. And then let me do this. Hold on one second. There you go. I'm not a children's entertainer, ladies and gentlemen. Let me show you my Yoshi hat. My Sonic hat. My Nazi hat. Wait, sorry, it's not a Nazi. My bison hat. <laughs> I'm not a. I'm not a fucking children's entertainer, ladies and gentlemen. Honestly, I'm not. I don't know what the fuck this is. I don't know what the fuck that is. Why the fuck does he have a whoopee cushion up here? I don't know. All the fucking vests. But he's not a children's entertainer. Oh, look, look at me! I'm a, I'm a big boy. I'm gonna. I'm not like those other guys. Woo, woo, woo! Oh my god! 
Okay, hold on. Let me pull this back. There you go. Not a children's entertainment, ladies and gentlemen. Everyone, Dark Side Phil here. The only detractor channel that I watch is Doody Stream. Here, the only detractor channel that I watch is Doody Streams. Oh my God! I think I just had a stroke. Okay, fuck you. You're not getting any more of my money. There. Okay, everybody. That was it. Uh, what sort of say? What sort of say? He, Phil Burt, our boy Phil Reno. He is totally. Totally uh, a positive man. He doesn't do, he does not dabble with drama at all. He is not a children's entertainer. entertainer. He's not a Muppet. And if, if one of his viewers asks him what's gone on over the year, you better fucking get ready to be berated because he doesn't have time to do that shit. Okay, you know what to do. Take it easy. Peace out.